Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Blasted Oasis. So I've been trying to get things sorted last night, but there's like so many zombies around here that have been causing me problems. Let's go clear these guys out. Let's get out of here. Get out of here. A whole lot of ya. I think there may have been a wandering horde in the morning. Because there's been a, just a ton of these guys. Alright. Slowly getting the building into place. So, what I did last night is I put everything away. And I moved everything from here. Downstairs. So all this stuff is empty now. Nothing up here. Uh, so it's all down in the kitchen for now. Did I leave that? No, it's not. Okay. Um, so I put it all down in the kitchen here for now. Uh, we'll, we'll figure it out later. But just like, you know, all our food is just down here for now. Figure out what we're going to do with it all later. Uh, but right now, it's just stored away down here. This is cool. It basically, uh, uh, the oven basically acts just like a regular uh, campfire. So it's an identical interface. It's just actually an oven, which is awesome. Uh, this is how I probably would have painted it, this like a block like this anyway. But not having the campfire on top is awesome. It uses up a whole space, so it's like... I mean, the campfire kind of does too, but at least it, it looks more real than having the campfire sitting on top of your uh, counter. Alright, so that's done. Now we've got to grab our stuff out of here. We've got to go to the traders today, so let's grab... You know what? Let's go put... Uh, what am I doing? Oh my god. Okay. Uh, all this stuff. I think we're going to take the motorcycle because I don't think we're going to be going... Um, we're, ah, I turned that on. I knew I turned that thing on. Should be off now. Right, perfect. Uh, we're not going to be going um, just down to the traders and stuff. We're probably going to want to go out and do something. So if we're going to go and do something, we definitely have to go off-road, which means we need a motorbike. Let's go ahead and throw this down. And we're going to put all our extra supplies in here. And I think that's it. I got an SMG upstairs that is working away. So let's go upstairs and gra blah, gra blah, grab that. Oh, I can make a level... You know what? Maybe we don't run with the shotgun during the week. Because I can make a level for Desert Eagle or Vulture now. I can make a level for Devil Desert Vulture. I just thought of that. We're running low on pistol parts. But I can scrap the one I have now. Uh... Yeah, we need 15 parts. But I can scrap the one I have now. Will that give us enough parts, though? Ooh, that's a rough question. Uh, let's find out. Um, it will. It'll give us the exact number of parts. Let's do it. Uh, let's scrap that. Because then we can leave the shotgun here. Let's grab... Uh, what do I want to use on this thing, though? Uh, we don't have a lot in there, but what does the shotgun have on it? We got a rad remover and the reflex sight we could put on it. Rad, re we got a rad remover in here. Full auto. Burst mode. That actually might be beneficial. We go with a burst mode on it. Until we can find a silencer, if we can use a silencer on it, that'd be good. Alright, let's go that route. So what does the Vulture need now? 50 forged steel, 15 duct tape, polymers, and springs. Which we got everything, I think. There's the duct tape, polymers, that, and... Should have thought of this last night. Alright, perfect. So let's go ahead and get that crafting. Five minutes, eh? Well, there's some zombies downstairs that need killing. Let's go do that. And then we can leave the shotgun ammo here. And we've been finding a lot of um, 
44 rounds too, right? You don't need to take a full stack, but that should probably be enough. We got shotgun rounds in the bike. We can pull those out. Actually, let's go ahead. Pull you and you out of there. You have a drum mag. Uh, let's take those two. And put it in here. Right? I think that's what, how we'll go. Sixty-two rounds. That's not bad. Hey, big mama. All right. So yeah, we only got two levels last night, so I, like I said, I put those straight into agility and another level of handgun to be able to craft these things. Alright, so we can put you and you away. So let's go grab the shotgun ammo out of the bike. Because we're not going to need that in there. So you can come out. We'll put half a stack of that in there. And then we'll grab a little bit more ammo when we're upstairs. Just got to have that little bit extra so if you're out for a little longer you've got, uh, you know, enough ammo that you're not running out all of a sudden. Alright, we'll take that. Yeah, we used a lot of shotgun ammo in the horde last night. I think we used like three stacks of ammo. At least it feels that way. It may not have been three stacks, but it felt like it was three stacks. Okay, you can go in there too. Doing okay on ammo, but we do need uh, AP. So let's see how we're doing here. All right, let's go ahead and grab then. Um, put you guys down here. Grab our coin. Probably not going to need it all. Let's grab you and you. Anything else can go on that? I don't think so. So I'll modify it with you. Get a little extra coin out of that. Uh, two, three, we're going to repair those guys. And that's legs and chest, so we can put you and you and you. Anything else in here? I don't see anything. Don't see anything else. Okay, what else can we sell here? You... Gonna hold on to it. Like, well, the steel stuff we should hold on to. That's iron. I should just scrap that, though. Take that. Take two of these, just in case. Ooh, the bandolier mod can go on something. Anything else? We don't have any guns to sell. No footwear. Okay, so let's go ahead and we'll repair these guys, because it's always worth it. Get a little bit more coin out of it. Repair you, repair you. That's fine. So we can go ahead and modify this guy. We'll put you in there, you in there, and you in there. That gives us, yeah, it's worth 3,000 now. And that's adding a couple of hundred, but that's fine. Let's repair this. And do we have anything that we can fit on there? I don't think so. Let's just take these guys and get them out of here and sell them. Barbed wire, I don't think will go on that. I think that it only goes on uh, clubs. Where is it? Yeah, we can't fit either of those things on there. All right, that's fine. That's fine. We got a bat here we can put them on, though, so let's might as well do that. If we're going to do it, let's make sure we get the uh, max value for it. Uh, let's repair you. I can only get one or the other. Fine. Fine, then. Leave that there. What else? 
Sure, sure, sure. All right, good enough. This should be done now, right? Three seconds, two seconds, one second. Awesomeness. Okay. Modify you. Uh, are we going with rad remover on this? Or burst? No, we got the SMG. Let's go rad remover. Let's go rad remover. Leave that in there. I think we're ready to go. Put you down this end. Bring my frames down. There we go. That's loaded. That's a fast loader. 13 rounds. One more than the last guy. Well, if I hit, it'll do a lot of damage. <laughs> All right, let's go down to the trader and do this stuff. So we may not be going very far today. Motorcycles only got like 10% gas, so... Uh, I don't know what we're going to do. I want to go up north and... Um, grab these guys too. And raid like a clunky oil. I think there's a... Well, you didn't do the clunky oils up north. There was a couple of them that um, we kind of missed out on. Because we, we were full. We, we were trying to get back, I think it was. Let's just scrap this. And we can ditch these. I leave your door open. I'm this sorry, bud. I don't care what folks say about Ooh, you. Ooh, steel boots, explain. tactical rifle, You're level four. In my book. Let's take that. We're going to just sell it back to him anyway. We don't need any bear dynamite. Uh, fetch clear. That's the same. Anything north? No. Clear zombies to the west, though. I've got a That's tier three. You. What's the matter? Uh, Chicken. <laughs> you laugh all you want, buddy. You laugh all you want. Fetch clear to the Doesn't south. Work. Clothing store. I don't want to go to a clothing store. Uh, I've got a task for you. Red Mesa. Uh, we already done that one. Uh, good loot at the end, though. Tier four to the I'll west. For you church. You oh, that's that big church. You know what? We're gonna okay. take that one because that's got a lot of bookshelves in it. Come back when it's done. All right. Let's get rid of all this stuff. Oop. Let's use this first. I guess you're not so bad after all. That's what my wife says. Alright, uh... Let's get rid of this stuff here. Alright, so we made up pretty well. We got a bunch of stuff, so let's go ahead. We're gonna go through all this stuff here. First, the secret stash. Ergonomic grip. That's the schematic we were looking for before, but we took the wrong one. So we'll take that. 44 Magnum. I should take that and just scrap it for parts. It's only two grand. Because we're out of pistol parts now, right? Ooh, Fireman's Almanac we don't have. We'll buy that one. Uh, needle and thread we've got. Pain kills we don't need. Uh, cement mixer. Let's let's buy a workbench for home. It saves us having to make it. We don't need another mixer, I don't think. We're doing well with two. We don't need any rebar frames. Uh... That stuff, pretty much, we all we sold them everything. Actually, how many lockpicks do we have? Let's top it up. Um, two sinks. These are the sinks I was looking for. These are the sinks that you were looking for. Empty shopping cart. Should get that. Just call it a granny cart. Okay, potatoes will take. Ooh, your raw meat will take. Didn't I say we needed that? Take your blueberries, your mushrooms, your corn. Uh, we'll take your bacon and eggs, because why not? We cut the money. Bullet tips. Take that. Take this. You know, I'm going to take this, because I don't know if we're going to actually uh, find nitrate, but if we do, then at least uh, we'll have them make lots of shotgun ammo. Okay, we'll buy you. Don't think we need that. 
Although I should be able to get the next level of uh, armor now. I can't remember if we had this at home or not. I'm pretty sure we do, but it's so cheap, we'll just buy it. All right, buddy. Are we done here? We are. How close are we to getting that? I don't know. I don't know. All right, let's go to the other trader. Now, we're going to need to get some gas on the way by the house. I think we got a bit sitting in there. What's up, nursing girl? Got a bit of an idea. Well, I don't know. I was just thinking that we could put the car down by the other trader. And if we go out, like, we can drive down there with the, in the car. Maybe, I don't know. And then get on the bike and go from there. All right, uh, we need gas, so that should be in, not in there. Gonna put a little bit in. We're gonna have to get some when we're out today. Hopefully we can find some. We're really running short on gas. All right, three minutes left on the candy. On the candy. Greetings, stranger. Greetings. I've got the best deals in Navis game. Do you? Well, let's see what you got. I'm replating mods. Level four pistol. I'm not buying that for the parts. Well, it's only two grand. It's what we paid for the other one. We got the coin. Bipod schematic. I'm gonna buy his fence posts too. Gyrocopter accessories. Are we going to get any better fuel efficiency out of a gyrocopter? I can't fly the damn thing anyway. I don't know why I'm bothering. 40 gunpowder. Ugh. Night vision goggles. Ooh, silencer mod. Do we have 100 mod in the bow? We do, so we don't really need that. Uh, ooh, we'll buy your eggs, buy your blueberries, buy your mushrooms. So one thing we don't have to worry about is food, that's for sure. Uh, we've got lots of antibiotics now, so I'm okay with that. Shotgun rounds will buy. Uh, it's AP 9 mil. We're going to buy it anyway. Bullet tips, buckshot. Uh... I think that's it. Oh, handgun parts, right. Okay, it's not so bad. I should probably buy the cobblestone though because I, I gotta upgrade a lot of the building. And you know what? This just saves me so much time at home. It's like less, that I, less things that I have to do. Oh, uh. Thank you, Survivor. Check back soon. Get new merchandise daily. I'm already like way overloaded here. You come back sometime. Ah, I might. I might not. Uh, let's modify you and let's take this rad remover off and put the silencer on. It lowers the damage, but we'll see how it works. And if it works well, then I think we'll ditch the bow. There's no point in taking the bow anymore if this is going to work. Oh, we want to buy these too. So let's dish them. I should just go ahead and scrap some of this stuff. Scrap this. We don't need these. Hang on to the pipes because I know we're going to use them. We can go ahead and scrap that. Some mechanical parts. Part used for crafting a vehicle. That's wheels. That's well, don't like we can't get these things. You know what I mean? Like we can always go wrench more cars. Go ahead and scrap that. That's what we're intending to do with it anyway. Okay, and then we need to take. Uh, these guys. That's cat food. We want dog food. Uh, let's buy the jailbreakers. Buy his pears. We'll just eat these now. Okay. And then we're on our way. We're, you know what? Uh, let's scrap these. We don't really... Uh, okay. I know what we're doing. 
Going home. Night raid. Excuse me. Okay, I think we're good to go here. We're going to go ahead and... Uh, start this going. Can't do it. We don't even have a thousand of this anyway. 446. Uh, how long is it going to take? 641? 641. So that will give us 4500. Uh, so let's take the rest of our gas, put it in the bike. I'm thinking we're going to go down south and, and go talk to the traders down there. On the off chance that they might have gas. Because we're really low now. I didn't think it was going to become this... Cru we're 69%. I didn't think it was going to be this crucial this fast. Um, actually, you know what? Is there... What did the clunky oil look like? It's this. So, is there any down there? We've got a trader here. And another trader up in here. But I don't see any clunky oils down here. What about out here? I don't see any there. Doesn't mean there isn't one, but I don't see any on the revealed part of the maps here. Right here. That's up north though. I thought there was another one over here somewhere too. Yeah, I hear you. All right, well, let's go do this mission. So I've got a bunch of hackers candies. I'm wondering, we should be looking for those school missions. Let's go check this bus out. We should look mi for missions that, that take us to these schools. Because then we can take the bus apart and then pop the quest, take it apart again. But pop the uh, the hacker's candy. I'm not going to do it for this one because there's only one bus here. But for those schools with more than one bus, it might totally be worth it. Ooh, that was nice. So we picked up 930 off the bus. So puts us at 95%. Okay, so I feel pretty good now. That should last for a few days anyway. Oh, there's a couple of shorty buses here. You know, the hacker's candy is only like... Like a hundred, so... Let's grab one out of here. Uh, let's go ahead and use that. I don't know if it'll really help us uh, with gas from these things, but we'll find out here in a second. Okay, another auger. Man, as much as I want to use the augers, I just, I can't afford it. Like, I can't afford the gas. Like, a tank of gas is like, I think, 500. And it goes really quick. I'd rather stick with coffee and the hackers, or the uh, Rockbuster candy. Because I, 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 I can keep going and not have to recharge my stamina as long as I have the coffee in me. Alright, what did that give us? 1500. Okay, so I, that's alright. feel pretty good. Let's fill this up. Drop all this crap in here. You know what? We still got some time on our hacker's candy here. Alright, what's inside? That was totally worth it. I completely forgot, forgot what our mission is. Oh, it's the church, right. Well, this should be scary as shit. 
Oh, there's two more buses here. Moe's here. There's a party. Look at this. What's up, Mo? I don't want to waste a round on you because, you know. Ooh. Pooping out some good stuff for me, eh? Let's go ahead and use this. A little bit of coin. Alright, drop this crap in here. Uh, go ahead and scrap that. Use this. What don't we need? Don't need that. Go ahead and scrap this. Keep the iron on us because we're most likely going to find it. We don't need that. Meow chow, let's go ahead and use it. Keep the water on us. Scrap that. Is there anything else in here? Let's take one of these with us. Because you know me, I'm not going to come back and get it. Alright, we'll pop these guys in the morning. Let's get in and start this while it's uh, still a little bit of light out here. Now, let's go ahead and see if we actually need the bow here. This is a clear of the area, eh? You got that right. We're going to clear this shit like there was shit that needed to be cleared. Oh, there's a snitch. Oh, yeah. It's nice that I remember some of these places. Because that would have been bad. Ooh. Now I should be able to... Yeah. Then we can go ahead and knock out the framework. Then jerks shouldn't be able to get in here. Okay, we got that guy. Well, he moves pretty quick. You coming upstairs? You are. You're just going to choose that door, are you? Ooh, ammo pile. Can we scrap these things? You can't. I'll probably end up ditching it, but we'll hold on to it for now. Okay, dead end that way. This is where all the bookshelves are. She's done. Now I got a question. I'm sure you guys can probably answer it. Oh, hey guys, what's up? Oh, hey. That was a bounce and a half. These guys can hear my... silence weapon, but uh, the guys in here can't. You're still alive, huh? Oh, you're a barrel. So, if you take the... Uh, if you use the uh, eye candy for bookshelves... I don't think it gives you any benefit at all, honestly. I don't think it's going to give you more of anything. Maybe I'm wrong. It just gives you a higher loot level. Right? But that doesn't mean, like, certain books aren't for higher levels, are they? I don't think they are. I think you can, uh... I think you can get them at any level. Okay, here's one we don't have. 10% more damage to vultures. That's always a win, because fuck vultures. Uh, nothing down here. Wow, we're getting ripped off here. That's dog food we want to keep. I think we need, I think that's learning elixir we need it for. Because uh, that's how dogs learn things, is by eating, do by eating dog food. They learn things real fast that way. Just gonna keep using these guys. Now I know we can make the uh, military fiber, but I don't want to do that unless I have to. Like honestly, you g 
when you're at a, this stage in the game and you've got so much money, why make it if you can just buy it? Okay, Magnum Enforcer. Last shot in this chamber does double damage. Water Purification Mod. Now we go this way. Into the cold depths of hell. Ooh, we got some radar, boys. We got four. Been a long time since I've been through this place. You see anybody in here? Oh. Fucking die! Yep, but thank every thank my starry skies every day that I upgraded to that military armor. All right, some more water. Let's go ahead and use this. Get a little bit of health back, like five points or something. Sounds like somebody's made their way in here. That was a one shot to the head. But you wish you hadn't uh, rushed in like that, Mo. I need to be very careful here, I think. Uh, I don't want to end up like last time. We don't need the duct tape. I've got so much glue at home, it's ridiculous. Oh, nice. Ten more rounds. I'll take that every single time. Yeah, black dye. That's nice, too. We forgot to put some dye on our SMG, so... At least we could go ahead and do that now. Ooh, more ammo. That's nice. Alright, uh... Modify you. You gotta put black dye on your weapon, because that way you're more stealthy. You tell him I told you that. That's, 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 that's what it works. That's how it works. Just in case you're wondering. Hey. Scrap. Don't do what I'm... What I'm telling you to do, do what I th I'm think you should be doing. Wait, is this guy? Yeah, he's already been searched. Uh, did this load for sure? It didn't. There's that last little settle, and if you're not, a, like, wary of it, it doesn't load correctly. Okay, we gotta go through there. Now we killed the footballer in here. Oh, I love uh, the atmosphere with this mod. The fog at night mod is just another black dye. Beautiful. It's just so good. It's it's it was what I've been missing in this game. It should be like like at nighttime. It should always be like this. Because it doesn't really. I mean, it does affect your frames per second a little bit. But um, it's nice because it just gives you that fog of war a little bit beyond your sight range, you know? It just adds so much atmosphere to the game. Alright, what do we got in here? Nothing? Who? You ain't taking me alive, copper. That's not what he wants to do anyway, but he's still not taking me alive. I don't know why I keep taking those pills. I got so many. I got like two stacks of them at home and All right, nothing in here. Where are we here? Oh, that's not good. Ooh, just enough rounds. Da -da 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 -da. Are we going down again? I guess we are. Oh, 
Are we? No, that's where we just were. That's a white. That is a fucking white. That's a white outside. to drop down? No. I got an SMG with your name on it. Come on in. Of course, the last time I said that, I had a uh, an M60 and it didn't help me. Well, we're fine this time. We may have to go back out to the bike and get some more ammo, though. Yeah, so I don't think I need the bow now. Probably gonna leave that off my my repertoire here. I mean, we're still uh, waking people up with the gun, but um, that's fine. I mean, it's not that bad. That's the library. So we're going this way. Can't go down. Oh, that's not good. Oh, there's a snake in here. Hey, free meat. Carol, where? Don't. No! Did you seriously just go down there? My goodness. Well, okay. That was interesting. I'm kind of shocked there was a snake in here, though. Okay, he must have crawled in from outside. I mean, there is an open door out there, so... Alright, we should be good up here now. Oh, looks like we just got... No, there's got to be more guys in here than that. Um, I guess we keep going up. Stay quiet. Oh, yeah. Okay, this room is, I think, is full of zombies. Yeah, you think? If we ever had use for a bow, it certainly is right now, and I can't see a goddamn thing at distance, so... We're gonna need to creep up on people here. Uh... Okay, we got someone right there. Looks like a big boy. I have no idea. That's a cop. Okay, what else do we have here? He's right there. If I use this, though... Get him to come closer. Where are you going? 
He's going upstairs. Well, let's get ready for him. I'm liking the uh, the uh, machine gun here. What are they doing? That guy's moving, but just barely. He's probably a crawler. Uh, that door's closed. Now, they're trying to get through here. Okay, let's make sure we kill you. Then we can go ahead and smash this guy out. Looks like there's only two left. He's at the door up here, I think. Yep, I hear him right here. Now that could be it here. Why do I feel like it's not? The arrow's pointing up, but it doesn't mean that... Uh... Ooh, a little confessional. Bless me, Father, for I have sinned. It's been 53 years since my last confession. Nothing in here, eh? Nothing. Ooh, a little ammo pile. I'm not sure why the priest needed the ammo pile, but... You know, it is the apocalypse, so maybe... Maybe he needed it. I don't know. I should take these. These are nice looking chairs. You know what? Let's just grab the chairs. Because if we could do like a... A dining room table, we could use these chairs. Says the guy trying to survive the apocalypse. Let's take the chairs out of here. They're light, let's just carry them. Alright, now we need to go up to the roof. But I think there's a whole other side of this building that we need to do. Okay, there's this one. I guess we've taken care of this side. The hard thing about coming here at night is you can't really see if you've missed anything. Go ahead and use that. We'll take these guys. Get a few hit points back. Yeah, we gotta go this way, I think. Right? I think so? I think so. I gotta say something here, and I don't—I don't mean it to be a shit, but it is kind of a shit thing to say. But I gotta say it anyway because I feel strongly about it. So, I've been watching Glock Nine series, um, and I've been watching Jewoodle series and Cap series. You know, I don't watch all of, like the whole videos from beginning to end the, each time, but I do watch them. Um. Just to get a sense of what other people are doing and how to play the game better, things like that, right? So, it's funny because Jewoodle in his one of the last series that he did, uh, he went ahead and was double looting buildings. Which means you go to the building, rather than taking the quest, you go clear the entire building out, then you come back out front, right, store everything that you've collected, then activate the quest which resets the POI and you go back in and you clear it again. So you whatever loot is at the end, you know, you get it twice. And 
You know, Glock 9's not a big fan of that. And he's mentioned it a couple times. I just hear a dog. But at the same time, like he's like, I, I don't want to do that. That's not how the game was intended. Yada, yada, yada. And I get that. The double loot though, especially if you're doing it on a, on a difficult building like this, it's like you're assuming the risk twice. And I'm fine with that. If you want to assume the risk twice, go ahead and do it. And if it's an easy building, go ahead and do it. Just means that, you know, it's an easy building. Because let's face it, there's not enough buildings in the game to make it seem like you're in a city or whatever. And this place is empty. Not a lot of bookshelves in this place. Um, so looting a building twice, you could just be like, you know, oh, it's, you know, we're uh, looting a separate building in the city or whatever, right? You can make an excuse for it. It's no big deal. But, that being said, these are fucking vultures too. Oh, you paid for that, buddy. Clear the area is done. Ugh. Oh. But anyway, as I was saying, um, so I can, I can, you know, you can, you can make the argument for the double loot, and you can make the argument against the double loot, right? Either way. But then, you know, Glock's like, I'm not about the double loot. But then he'll go ahead and like sneaky loot a place. He's already been there, so he knows where the main loot is. So he'll go and just do the main loot. It's like, okay, well, isn't that cheating? <laughs> you know what I mean? The game's not designed for you to sneaky loot places. The game's designed so that if you've got a dungeon POI, you follow the dungeon POI. And the way I look at it, it's like, yeah, okay, it's, you know, you you play the game you want to play, how like, you play the game how you want to play the game. If you're going to do double loot, do double loot. Who the hell cares? Right? You're going to do single loot, do single loot. If you want to just sneak you loot a place, like, you know, Bob's Boars, if you want to go in and, and just, you know, break in because you know where the loot is and go sneaky loot, go for it, right? Who cares? Just play it how the game you want to play it. But, you know, don't disparage somebody because they're sneaky looting and then go, or sorry, because they're double looting and then go sneaky loot a place. It's like, you could say the game's not designed to double loot, but it's not designed for you to sneaky loot either. <laughs> Anyway, that's just my that's my two cents. Play the game how you want. I don't really care. Doesn't matter to me at all. But I don't, you know, pointing fingers at somebody because they play a game a certain way. It's like who cares? It's a game. It's like it's not it's not real life. It's a game, and if you want to play the game how you want to play it, who the hell cares? Play it on super easy if you want, and then brag about how good you are. Like wh uh, why do I care? Doesn't affect my life in any way. Okay, tack rifle schematic. That's a sniper rifle, right? It is. Finally getting to some really good loot here. Scrap that. Alright, some more 44 ammo. That's a bonus too. Alright, how are we doing here? Alright, we were very discerning on our on our thieving process. So across the street. I'm not dropping down that way, forget that. Across the street we got those two buses. So we're gonna do that, but not right now. We'll do it tomorrow. Because uh, I'm going to end this episode here. I think that was a pretty good run. I could have done that with night vision goggles. I'm not sure how with this fog, how well you'd be able to get that done. Like, if it would cut through the fog or not. Maybe you should try it and see. Just as an experiment's sake. Uh, we got the... Wait, where's the other... We've got another quest here. Tier 4 clear. That's the return. Oh, the fetch clear is up here. Is that the... That's the high school, isn't it? Is it? I guess I could probably look at the quest and figure that out, eh? School 1, it is. Okay, I think we're gonna... We're gonna go and wrench the buses across the street in the morning. We turn this stuff home, and then I think that one up north we'll do later. We'll go back and get another quest from our trader, the guy closest to us tomorrow. Uh, and probably work on the base. We're, we've, we should get some good fuel out of those buses, probably enough for another tank load, which means we could go north. We could get the bus up north twice. 
that'll probably be good. I think I don't know if there's a bus around back or not of that big school, but we'll have to check it out. I don't think there is. I think it's just out front. All right, but I'm going to end this episode here as it slowly begins to lighten up out front. Um, going to go down, get some stuff in the bike, and then tomorrow we'll start by wrenching apart those buses that are down here. Uh, where? On this side? Down wherever they are. We'll wrench them apart, get some more gas out of them, and then um, we'll go from there. All right, so I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.